easy level. Let me play it. You can watch. Fucking hell. Good story. Uh, gotta go. Great, just great. Got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key. Looking for something? Won't find it here. Nothing to find. Borked. It ain't 
working? <gasps> Jesus! You want a hint? I can tell you how to fix it if you really want to fix it. Old people need help with this stuff sometimes. So, yeah, turn it off first, then turn it back on. You know, I can tell you where to look for the on button for a thousand ads. Interested? <laughs> okay, Eddie's are all yours. Nova, done deal. So, switch, where is it? I don't know exactly, around here. Telling you where to look, not where to find it. Just like I said. We'll play hot and cold. If you're close or far, we'll holler hot or cold. Let's start playing. You'll get it. Warmer, getting hot. Hot, red hot. What the fuck? My PD now. And the best fucking bit too. Jankass power grid. Yo, yo, yo! Don't even think about flatlining here! I'm gonna touch a corpse! Uh, uh, this... Uh, this gotta be what having a fucking stroke feels like. Perfect, Johnny. Thanks. Wasn't on purpose. Just gotta pick up the pace. Clock's ticking. I'm doing what I can. for breakfast, noodles for dinner. I gained like seven pounds since we moved here from Watson. Ah.
This is perfect. NCPD, gang wars, not in Dogtown. Taxes, who the fuck are you going Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Cream Stick. Here's to you, Carnalito. I don't think I'd recognize you in the street today. Hey, you made it. Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. You know, surprise me with the invite. Surprised? Really? Didn't know what to make of it. <laughs> but yeah, it's nice to press pause once in a while. I wrote you because... Because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission, not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. Okay, so, what you want to talk about? I mean, it's not like I have an agenda typed up. I just want to be a normal fucking person for a little bit. Myself, specifically. Just me. Just Alex. Starting to make a lot more sense why retirement was your condition to accept the mission. Guess you'd call it burnout. Or maybe just the need for anything resembling normal. If I even know what that is anymore. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now if, you know, life had taken a different turn? Maybe I'd still be with my family, out on the road. As in nomads? Mm-hmm. The backers. Probably somewhere in the Midwest right now. Scraping together a few eds from the corn harvest. Then long conversations over beer. Isn't it time we joined Snake Nation? <laughs> Soaking in that big sky. Or the stink of chew in some rat hole motel. <laughs> or that. To your health. Okay, now you. Who would you be if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals especially. Seriously? <laughs> Call me old fashioned. So yeah. Guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> Got any dream roles? Norma Desmond, Sunset Boulevard. <laughs> Guessing that doesn't ring any bells. Not a single one. No surprise. It's ancient far as films go. I have a soft spot for tragic characters. Not to mention I see something of myself in her. Neither of us know when to let go. To a normal life. Maybe we all enjoy one someday. Hey, Amen. Ooh, 
I love this song. Don't do this often, I'm guessing. Busting moves? <laughs> Can't say I do. What gave it away? <laughs> Wasn't thinking of dancing, but never mind. See you on BD posters in no time. I know it. First, retirement. See you soon, B. Here we are. You and me, face to face. Sure we're alone. Wouldn't want any unpleasant surprises. No surprises. Except maybe you're already one of us. Don't trust a soul. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. Means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off, while I was here in NC on assignment. Uh -huh. 
Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills. Crack open beers. Talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasting funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scop dogs around. He shit talking one of his chews. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Yeah. No feeling. Got a place you hold close to your heart, too? Not a place. That was always changing. But people, sure. Memories of home. Yearning to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. <sighs> Suppose we should get back to the here now. Attack on Myers. You schemed it up with Hansen. I know that. Yeah, Neural Matrix was pricey. But honestly, I... I never thought he'd try to kill her. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself, too, almost. Ground the plane. That was the plan. Didn't expect he'd blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So, what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix, and for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. I fucked everything up. I know, V. But I had no choice. Always got a choice, Song. Always. Did it. Not this time. For Myers, the NUSA, I'm just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools. They don't get to make decisions, or choose to retire. Burden of past mistakes. We both bear it. It ain't easy. Me for the biochip, you for the black wall. You mean to say, it's my fault? No, just that when you try to save yourself, it's usually somebody else who pays the price. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Ain't that the brutal fucking truth? You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me? Don't trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm-hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk, 
So he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Uh, join and serve or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently, seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence, yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. I want to ask, actually, what happened exactly, you know, when you reached past the Black Wall? Now the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life? But it just turns up... blank. Mean losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes... I, I lose control. Or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else. That feels horrible. Felt it too. With the Chimera. Like a living nightmare. Yeah. More and more, I get the sense someone's standing behind me. But there's never anyone there. Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you and myself. I need to get away. From Kurt, then USA, Reed. From everything. Speaking of, out of everybody out there, you saw Hansen as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Meyer's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk wanted that. That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City's just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved, or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? Be nice to have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission, grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then? You helped me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Should be pretty clear. I mean, to survive, too. 
I appreciate your honesty. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hansen.